Hi guys, welcome back to Dengue House Fashion. Yes, welcome back to our channel. So today's tutorial will be about the sewing of this of this dress popping up on your screen. So if you want to know how this dress was patterned, I'll be dropping the link down below. This is just a sewing tutorial of the pattern dress already. So we've cut out our pattern. The only thing we did was to elongate the length because of the um, desired length of the client and our paper wasn't up to the desired length so that is the only thing which we did and um, this is our back block this is the left side of the back block this is the right side of the back block so just stay tuned if you really want to know how this tutorial was this uh, sorry this dress was sold from start to finish and they were to stay tuned thank you so let's head right to the sewing machine piece that I made I cut out two pieces of this part so I'm about to join the upper front block with the down front block. So I notched this part, the three and a half part. I notched it, the three and a half, where it stopped. So I notched it. This is it. I notched it here. So that's where I'm going to start my sewing from. So just... So let's get started. And if you want to know how the pattern was drafted for this particular blog um sewing this particular dress i'll be dropping the link down below i'll be dropping the link down below so we're getting started already I'll be dropping the link down below so just take note we started sewing from that three inches uh, where the three inches ended, so you just take note of that. I started sewing where the three inches ended there, so we are done with the sewing. So this part now will bring it like so. Let me just explain this blue part now. I'm going to take it down, then make sure I connect both colors together so just join them like so so take note So this is what we have now this is what we have as you can see so I haven't touched the blue part at all so I'm just going to join both sides at the neck area here so let me just take out my pin and make sure we have a good the oboe sides are aligned so So I'm just going to join the neck area together. Remember, it's a turtle neck dress. So this is what we have. So we're just going to go now and tape this part down. Tape this part down. So I'm about to tape the blue part down. So I'm about to tape it down like so. Just making sure I have a flat. Okay, make sure you stretch out your fabric so you don't have puffing at that in there. This is what we have. So just go ahead and pull out our threads and yes, you can see it's almost performing what we are 
the JD one. So this is it. So we're going to bring the side back log and we'll join the sides together. We'll be joining the sides together on yeah we join the sides together so this is the front part of the dress and we'll be joining the sides together first of all pin down the shoulders we we'll pin it down first of all so let me just take the pins here Pin down the shoulders as you can so you can see what I'm doing. So we're first of all pinning down the shoulders and we'll be joining the sides on one inch all the way from you know our seam allowance is one inch, so we'll be joining the sides on one inch all the way from. armhole to the bottom first of all that's what we're doing first of all hope you can see what i'm doing so we're going to join the sides say all the way from the armhole to down to the hem part one inch all the way so that's what we're doing trying to connect it like so joining both sides and we took our measurement from the zipper part there as you can see we've already taken our measurements so just sew all the way to the hem part so that's what we're going to do now we've already taken our measurements so we'll join the sides first of all then we took out our measurement so that is what we did but just make sure you pin them every aspect so you don't have shortage so that's what we did so we're just going to sew all the way to the bottom to the hem part there i didn't back stay because you know this is the zipper part and we're not going to we're still going to open it up it because we'll fix our zipper there but just keep making sure that your fabric are aligned with the both sides are properly aligned one side is no longer that we need to we don't have issues just keep making sure of that So this is what we have now. So this is what we have. Yes, yeah, a bodycon dress. It doesn't have a slit. Yeah. So we've done our sleeve already. We've done our sleeve. But we just want to already pin it out. As you can see, we've pinned it on the bodies of the fabric, and. The same thing I'll be dropping a link on how to pattern this kind of sleeve so I'll be dropping a link sorry I'll be making a video on how to pattern this kind of um, sleeve so we just want to go and join the sleeve part now then so you see to stay our touch neck part there so we stayed it and we pinned it around all through the neck part so 
we're just going to sew on a straight line then we're done so it's always good to have it ironed out properly so you don't have issues with folding at the other side I already pinned out my pin my zipper the way I want it fixed so I'll just come straight here and fix it so I'll just sew them down and that's the last part of this dress so we'll just sew down our zipper Cut our pins in. Come back with dress fitting. We're just taking out our pins. So, and come back with dress fitting. So that's all.